Did you know that walking can significantly improve your cardiovascular health? It's a simple yet powerful action that can transform your well-being. When you incorporate walking into your daily routine, it's like flipping a power switch in your body. You begin to breathe deeper, your heart rate increases, and your blood vessels become more flexible. This is not just some casual observation. Major health organizations and universities have backed this up with extensive research. The Mayo Clinic, the Harvard School of Public Health, and the American Heart Association all echo the same sentiment. Walking is a key ingredient in the recipe for cardiovascular health. The beauty of walking lies in its simplicity. No fancy equipment, no expensive gym membership, just you and the open road. And the benefits are not just physical. Walking also helps to elevate your mood, boost your energy levels, and enhance your sleep quality. But how exactly does walking impact our cardiovascular system? How does it affect men and women differently? Is there a minimum number of steps or minutes you need to walk each day to reap the benefits? And what's the best time of day to walk? So let's dive into how walking can be a powerful tool for enhancing our cardiovascular health. Let's delve into the science behind the benefits of walking on cardiovascular health. According to studies conducted by various universities and health organizations, walking is not just about tranquility or reconnection with nature, but it also has substantial impacts on our health, particularly on our heart. Research indicates that a brisk walk for just 30 minutes a day can lower the risk of heart disease and stroke by 27%. Studies also demonstrate that regular walking regulates blood, reduces high cholesterol, and enhances the efficiency of the heart. It's no surprise then that our body responds positively to this simple exercise, adapting to a healthier rhythm. This is not just a metaphorical dance between your body and nature, but a scientific reality that showcases the impact walking can have on your cardiovascular health. Walking can be seen as a small step towards a healthier life. Let's explore this further and understand how walking can truly help us lead a healthier life. Research studies from top universities have shown that regular walking can have a profound impact on our cardiovascular health. Walking, a simple yet effective form of exercise, has been proven to reduce the risk of heart disease. It's not just about keeping the heart pumping, but what happens inside our bodies as we walk. The heart muscle strengthens, the blood vessels become more flexible, and our heart rate, cardiac stroke volume, and blood pressure all improve. This is like giving our cardiovascular system a regular tune-up, keeping it running smoothly and efficiently. When we walk, our bodies produce hormones and neurotransmitters that help regulate heart function and blood pressure. These chemical messengers are key players in maintaining our cardiovascular health, making walking a holistic approach to heart care. But does walking affect everyone's cardiovascular health in the same way? Not exactly. Studies suggest that men and women may experience different cardiovascular benefits from walking. For instance, postmenopausal women might see more pronounced benefits in blood pressure control, while men might experience greater improvements in heart muscle strength. So how much walking is needed to reap these benefits? The Department of Health and Human Services recommends at least 30 minutes of physical activity daily. However, it's important to remember that every step counts. Even short bouts of walking throughout the day can add up to significant benefits. Is there a best time of the day to walk? Morning, noon, or evening? The answer is, it doesn't really matter. What's important is getting those steps in, no matter what time of day it is. Walking is a flexible activity that can be incorporated into any daily routine, making it a sustainable and accessible choice for improving cardiovascular health. As we can see, walking is not just a simple exercise, it's a life-enhancing activity that can significantly improve our cardiovascular health. So let's make every step count towards a healthier heart. As we transition from understanding the cardiovascular benefits of walking to considering the ideal walking regimen, let's delve deeper into the physiological benefits walking offers. As you walk, your heart muscles become stronger. Your cardiovascular health is improving. Remember that walking isn't just about the peace and tranquility found on the journey, but also about the physical benefits it provides. It's about the strengthening of your heart muscle and the improvement of your cardiovascular health. 
With each step you take, appreciate the physiological benefits it delivers and enjoy these moments of peace and connection. You might be wondering, how much should I walk to reap these benefits? Well, the answer might surprise you. According to the Department of Health and Human Services, a minimum of 30 minutes of physical activity per day is recommended. Now let's break that down. That's about 3,000 to 4,000 steps. But remember, the more you walk, the more benefits you can gain. Research from Harvard University suggests that the more steps you take, the better. But don't fret it if you can't hit 10,000 steps per day right away. It's not about reaching that number overnight. It's about gradually increasing your steps and creating a routine that's manageable and enjoyable for you. Now let's talk about when and how to walk. Is it better to walk in short bursts or long stretches? Well, both have their merits. Short, brisk walks can increase your heart rate and improve your mood while longer walks can boost your endurance and help you burn more calories. So, why not mix it up? Maybe take a quick walk during your lunch break and then enjoy a leisurely stroll after dinner. Variety can make your walking routine more exciting and sustainable. But what about the best time of day to walk? Well, there's really no definitive answer to that. Some people prefer morning walks to kickstart their day, while others enjoy evening walks to unwind. The important thing is to find a time that suits you and to stick to it. Consistency is key. Let's not forget about the pace of your walk. A brisk walk, where you can still talk but not sing, can help you reap the maximum benefits. But remember, it's not about the speed. It's about maintaining a steady, comfortable pace that gets your heart pumping. Remember, the key is consistency. Establishing a regular walking routine is more important than the duration of each walk. So start small, gradually increase your steps, mix up your routine, and most importantly, enjoy the journey. Walking isn't just about improving your cardiovascular health, it's about enhancing your overall quality of life. As we delve into the scientific underpinnings of walking, it's critical to discuss its meditative aspect. Picture yourself on a peaceful walk through a serene park at sunset, your senses actively engaging with the natural world around you. This is the essence of walking meditation, a physical activity and mindfulness. From a physiological standpoint, walking meditation has considerable health benefits. It affects not only our mental health, but also our cardiovascular system. As you walk, focusing on your steps, breath, and surroundings, your heart operates in a more relaxed and efficient manner. Your steady heartbeat facilitates better blood circulation, reducing the strain on your heart. Remember to concentrate on your breath to foster a sense of calm, which can result in a decrease in your blood pressure levels. The physical sensation of each step, the breeze on your skin, the warmth of the sun, all serve to ground you in the present, creating a break from the hustle of daily life. This mindfulness coupled with physical activity provides a tranquility that doesn't just soothe the mind but also positively impacts your body's physiology. Walking is more than just physical movement. It's a link to our inner peace and an intimate connection with the world around us, all underpinned by scientific principles. Let's delve deeper into how walking affects our body's physiology particularly the cardiovascular system. Walking, a simple and effective form of exercise, is a bit like a tune-up for your body, particularly your heart and blood vessels. As you walk, your heart works harder to pump blood to your muscles, which helps strengthen the heart muscle over time. Studies from Harvard University indicate that regular walking can reduce the risk of heart disease by as much as 30%. But it's not just your heart that benefits. Your blood vessels get a workout too. As you walk, the blood flow increases, helping your arteries stay flexible and open. This can lower your risk of high blood pressure and other cardiovascular issues. Walking also impacts your heart rate, cardiac stroke volume, and blood pressure. When you walk, your heart rate increases, which improves your heart's efficiency. Your cardiac stroke volume, or the amount of blood pumped out of your heart with each contraction, also increases, enhancing your overall cardiovascular health. But what about blood pressure? Well, walking helps lower blood pressure by improving your blood vessel health. And as we mentioned earlier, it's a bit like taking the pressure off a hose. The water flows more easily and there's less strain on the hose itself. Now let's talk about hormones and neurotransmitters. These chemical messengers play a vital role in how your body functions. When you walk, your body releases endorphins, the so-called feel-good hormones. This not only improves your mood, but also has positive effect 
on your heart by reducing stress and anxiety, which can contribute to heart disease. Moreover, walking also increases the level of neurotransmitters like serotonin and norepinephrine, which help regulate heart rate and blood pressure. So in essence, walking can help keep your heart ticking along nicely, like a well-oiled machine. From our heart to our blood vessels, walking has a profound impact on almost every aspect of our cardiovascular system. So what are some key takeaways about walking and its benefits for our cardiovascular health? Let's sum it up with these five tips. Number one, walking is a simple and effective way to improve health. It requires no special equipment and can be done virtually anywhere, making it a highly accessible form of exercise. Number two, the Department of Health and Human Services recommends at least 30 minutes of physical activity daily. Walking fits the bill perfectly and can be easily integrated into your daily routine. Number three, walking can indeed have very different effects on men's and women's cardiovascular health. However, regardless of these differences, the benefits are undeniable for both. Number four, there isn't a universally best time to walk. Whether it's morning, noon, or evening, what matters most is that you're moving and getting those steps in. And lastly, not only does walking enhance your physical health, but it also boosts your mood and energy levels. This dual benefit makes it an excellent choice for a healthier lifestyle. Keep these tips in mind as you incorporate walking into your daily routine. And always remember that every step counts. Walking is a simple, accessible, and incredibly beneficial exercise that can significantly enhance our cardiovascular health. Let's make it a point to incorporate this healthful habit into our lives. Whether it's a brisk morning walk, an afternoon stroll, or an evening saunter, every step counts towards a healthier heart and a better life. Start small, perhaps just a 10 minute walk around the block, gradually increasing your pace and distance. Again, consistency is key. Don't forget to keep track of your progress. Setting achievable goals and monitoring your steps can serve as a great motivator. Walking isn't just a journey of a thousand steps, but a journey towards a healthier heart and a healthier you. Now join us in our next video as we explore how walking can also significantly improve our mental health and mood. Stay tuned and keep walking. Thank you for being here today. Cheers to your health.